Hi, I'm Mike from Scoutadelic and find out how I did this. Now this month is all about science and experiments and really fun stuff. Now today we're going to do something that will need water, two glasses, some food colouring, salt and obviously a spoon and some card. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to fill up both cups full of water and they need to be really full. Hence we're here so that if I do obviously get anything spilt it's not going to be much, it's not going to be bad. Okay, because safety is super. Hence. So you need to fill up both cups right to the top. Okay, so they need to be obviously that, that full. So we have one full glass, and we've got one almost full glass. Now I've put it in this beaker just in case it's obviously going to spill. Um, it's going to obviously spill on there and not all over me, but who knows. Then with this one, so the one that obviously you've got the full, you want to put some salt. You want to put quite a lot of salt. So that is salty water, okay? And then what you want to do is you want to put the card on top of your water, like so. And then what you're going to do is you're going to flip the water upside down. So this is where this could go totally wrong, but it's on camera, so here we go. All right, so make sure that that is like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put this on top of this like so, okay? So now we've got, obviously, the two cups together. Okay, you want to line them up as best as you can. And then slowly but surely, you're going to edge Ta-da! <laughs> what you're pondering is why is one bit of water still at the bottom and the other bit of water is at the top? Well, that's simple. We put salt in that. Now, the density of salted water versus normal water is heavier. So therefore, that is at the bottom. And if you notice, our normal water is at the top here, all right? Even if I shook this up, what should happen is that the salt water should still sink to the bottom and the normal water would obviously still stay at the top. The reason why we put the food colouring is so that you can actually see the difference. If you notice, there's no green that is actually going up at all. It's staying at the bottom there and that's all about density. So we're going to talk about that a little bit more tomorrow, but that is a cool trick that you can do <laughs> if you're good with obviously card. Um, with your friends and amaze them with something sciency. How cool is that? Hey, if you have liked that, then don't forget to obviously give it a like because that is kind of cool and sciency, scientific. Um, if you also know this month, I'm giving away Oggy badges. They're very limited. There are only a few of them out there. So you've got to make sure that you are in with a chance of winning. So all the details are in the link below on the description. So don't forget, 
an Oggy badge, very limited edition. If you've liked this, then don't forget to obviously share it with your friends and consider subscribing. It's Science Month. You might as well. How cool! Hey! <laughs>